Good morning, guys. Eric Tadros with Digital World Citizen. Hope you're doing well. We have a great conversation on the law of attraction right after this. Eric Tadros back with you guys for Digital World Citizen. Daniel and myself talk about the new world that's coming about and uh, in a, sometimes in a spiritual way, sometimes in a technological way. Uh, I'm here in my car today with my dog. Where's my dog? Yeah, my dog is right there. You guys see my dog? No, you don't see him yet. He's right there. My dog is there. I'm Eric Tadros and uh, we talk about the new world because the old world is changing. Um, just decided to do a video in my car. Talk about the law of attraction that I really tapped into the last uh, few years, but uh, more particularly the last few days and months. Such an important topic in our world, such an important uh, idea and concept that we don't know enough about, uh, we don't use enough, the power of our feeling in our bodies and the power of the words that we use and the programming that we um, give ourselves or our, our own programming uh, I don't believe we do uh, we don't we don't our self-talk is usually not uh, good uh, enough and I uh, keenly detect that lately in my friends and my um, my surroundings you know uh, they say things that don't benefit them they say things that don't help them uh, ideas that are not positive uh, or, or winning ideas for them. So uh, my uh, friend has a uh, issue with his uh, relationship and his his um, his girlfriend. Uh, they're splitting up, and she's seeing somebody else. And he's saying, "Yeah, she's already in love. She's already this. She's already that. She doesn't love me anymore." And he doesn't know that for a fact, but he's doing some creating, putting into life ideas that don't even exist, uh, are not even necessarily true, because he doesn't know. Uh, what the situation is anyway so uh, instead of saying something he doesn't know about he's putting uh, saying negative stuff about his, uh, his 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 ex instead of saying you know she wants to make things right she's trying she's hurt she's doing her best uh, she's trying to uh, work it out in the meantime you know you create your own reality so if that's not the case of what's happening at least he's saying something that might be possible in the future right so that's just one example uh, in terms of a, a, a relationship. But I do notice that with uh, money, uh, abundance, most people do not do not uh, have any self-talk or have repetitive self-talk that's been anchored for so many years. So like, you know, I only make 500 bucks a week. They don't, they don't repeat it to themselves, but it's always what's happening. So uh, what I recommend is, is really... Um, uh, creating some affirmations um, to really create into life the things that you want to happen. So, uh, an, an, an interesting affirmation. And people call this a PNL, uh, linguistic programming pro program, programming language. PNL is in French. Programmation uh, neurolinguistique. That's a French term. But in in English, so one affirmation. I just was talking to Daniel about this just a few seconds ago. Um, one affirmation that I, I, I just created, I, I said, hey, you know, take a few moments to listen to uh, these affirmations. And I, th I said, I think you should write a few. I think we should really, these days, uh, create our, so, you know, some good affirmations for us and repeat them because everything we say and think uh, manifests automatically, instantly. So I said, one affirmation that I created for myself, and I probably will put a list of them uh, below. I said, our companies, products, YouTube channels, investments, music videos, and everything else that we create or any ideas that we have help others so much uh, that it comes back to us uh, a thousandfold in energy, uh, financial energy, uh, and human energy. You know, that's just an affirmation that I created. So I have a another buddy that uh, he's having issues with his, his, his couple as well. And I follow up with him uh, uh, every day or so, and I ask him, "So, how's it going?" And he says, "Well, she's still saying the same thing." I said, "Okay." Uh, and what are you saying? What what things are you telling yourself? You know, uh, because you create your own reality. So, 
if she's saying something that he doesn't like, that's what she is saying and vibrating. I said, but what are you telling yourself about the relationship? What are you telling yourself about your, your, your girlfriend? So I said, are you saying the th same things she's saying? Or do you want a, another reality? So if you want another reality, let's find things you can tell yourself and your ideas and self-talk that, that are beneficial to you, that are satisfying to you. So uh, you can, he could say things like, you know, my our experiences, everything we go through always helps our relationship uh, to grow bigger and stronger. And we come closer every time we have a challenge. That's one affirmation that could be beneficial to the relationship. Um, so I'm talking about relationships and money and everything else is, is related to our own self-talk. Be aware of other people's self-talk and especially people close to you because those are the ones you have most friction with, most experiences with, and they affect your vibration. If they wobble and criticize you, like example, we're going to some examples right now. In our, in our, in our YouTube videos, our, our, our people in our surroundings might say something about this video and what we've said in this and that and they it has other people talking about our music videos in a certain way and saying no I don't like when they say this and people don't like that uh, when you when you talk about this topic it's too controversial it's too uh, polarizing and that's what they think and I'm like okay so we had this discussion with Daniel you guys can see the uh, the store behind me, the Ultramar. So that's their their perception. I was ha having a conversation with Daniel and we were like, okay, they think that about what we do. I said, why don't we meet, do an affirmation on that? So I said, okay. I said, the videos and things we create are ha very heartfelt and our its intention is to help uh, people grow and learn from our own experiences and our intentions are true and, uh, and uh, true and um, uh, real and um, all we want to do is help so anything we say or do doesn't really matter is that our intention is the right one and it brings good to the world uh, so it, it brings good to us as well um, uh, also so uh, so I'm just making these affirmations up because I, I know what to do and say when there's something that happens that is not what I want to feel or see. So uh, that's what it is. You guys see my tan. I spent the day on the beach yesterday because I do create my reality and I do follow my bliss. And I do things that I love doing every single day, every single minute. Because when I love doing things and uh, I feel good things just come things just occur in the right energy i get the right phone call i get the right person calling i get the good idea i get the right video that becomes viral and that's what the law of attraction talks about that's what it is if you guys know that every word that's pronounced creates a feeling in my body and an emotion and it creates a thor an a, a, a electromagnetic thor that lives in the world and affects the world around me and affects myself so guys law of attraction is real we all manifest at different levels i manifest uh, all the time every day every second every word every thought i say i do manifest and i'd like you guys to manifest what you want what you love say what you want say what is satisfying do what is satisfying feel what is satisfying Give yourself the feeling in your body that you want before you actually live it and you will be living in the future. So you, you're, you're, you want to be loved, feel the love in your heart beforehand. Your body does not know the difference between a real and the fake event. It just knows the event, what it's feeling. So if you're falling off uh, in your dream off a 10 foot, uh, 100 foot building, your body is really falling off the building same thing here uh, if you're feeling the love you are loved end of story if you're feeling the money the abundance whatever abundance means in your life you are abundant the past does not exist the future is not created 
The present is the gift. Leave you guys on that. That was a great conversation. Love you, miss you, kiss you.